Hi, welcome back to video tutorials for your photo. Today we have a really interesting tutorial on our hands. Um, I'm going to show you how to turn this black and white photo I took in Yucatan, Mexico into a colored picture. We're going to get a bit crazy with the colors, so feel free to experiment. You can download this picture on our website so you can try it out for yourself. Um, okay so let's get started the first thing you want to do is duplicate the background layer we're just, just gonna put okay and then we're gonna create six new layers by clicking here and create new layer okay there we have six new layers and then we're gonna start renaming them so we're gonna double click and the first one is gonna be called water the second one is gonna be called I'm just gonna put extra the third one is going to be called plants. The fourth one is going to be called um, wood. The fifth one is going to be called sky. And the sixth one is going to be called sky too. Okay, we're going to start by painting the water layer. So we select the water layer. Um, we choose a blue, a nice blue. And we're going to take the brush tool. Just pick a size you're comfortable with and take the hardness a bit down. If it's on 100, just slide it down to 20, I don't know. We're going to start painting only over the water. I'm going to do it this really fast. You should be more careful with it. Um, now, the water doesn't really look very real right now. So what we have to do is take this layer and change it from normal to soft light. Now, this looks much better. If you don't like the soft light effect, you can just play around here and choose other ones. Probably darken. No, darken is not that well. Okay, overlay. You can choose um, from these different types so, so you get more cool effects. Now I'm going to finish painting over here. You should take your time for this to get better results. I'm just going to do it really fast. Okay, this, this works. Now you can see we have we're getting a pretty interesting effect right now. We have a black and white image and we can only see the watercolor. So actually this, this looks this looks pretty nice already, but we're going to push it a little bit further. We're going to paint the plants next. We're going to choose a green color and the type layer is going to be um I don't know, soft light again. And we start painting over here. Now you have to be careful that this doesn't happen. I'm just going to undo that. It did undo brush tool. Okay, this looks pretty good. Now you're starting to see what we're getting here. It looks pretty interesting. Um, next we're going to paint the wood. We're going to take a brown color and we're going to change the wood layer into overlay. I'm going to make the brush size a bit smaller. Yeah, this one works. Okay, I'm going to zoom in. Now, the thing is, you have to get crazy with this one. You could probably paint the wood um, red or something like that, so it looks a bit more interesting. You can basically do whatever you want here. I'm just playing around here okay now this is starting to look really interesting now um, for the sky the sky is a bit difficult on this one because we don't have any clouds so it's probably not gonna look that real so we're just gonna mess around it and we're gonna paint it I don't know let's make it pink why not Okay, I'm, I'm just going to leave it right before it hits the plants and I'm going to turn the layer type into color burn, no that doesn't work, okay into linear burn and the sky too I'm going to paint it in blue. I've actually never tried this before I'm just going to see what it looks like, um, color burn. No, I should better just 
Let's see. Yeah, overlay. I don't know. I'm just playing around here. Um, okay. I'm going to take the erase tool now. This one's pretty big. Make it um, as big as you can and start erasing a little bit of the sky. Just erase outside and around the image to get a cool effect. Now I'm gonna throw in a little bit of yellow. I'm not very good painting so you could probably get something better than this. So over the sky I'm gonna paint a little bit of or, yeah I'm gonna paint over the sky a little bit of um, yellow. I'm gonna make the brush size a bit bigger and just start painting outside it just to get some crazy colors okay I'm not quite sure about the effect I'll probably erase the 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 yellow part but you can see how you can just play around the different colors you can probably turn the plants out um, pink yeah, just have fun and play around it. You can do a lot of cool effects with this one. Now, um, if you're done, if you like the result, I don't actually like it, but I'm gonna do it anyways. You just select all these layers by um, by having shift and just selecting all these layers with the last background copy, and then we're gonna go to layer, merge layers. And now we can compare it with the black and white image. Now I hope this tutorial was useful and you had a better result. Just get crazy with the colors and start painting your black and white images. Have fun and see you later.